If you have any question, you can ask me. Welcome to everyone. We are going to discuss Tintern Abbey by William Wordsworth. Very first, a number of images are given. Please try to observe the images. In the last class, you have seen that I didn't show the images. Today, I have added this one. So, the images, what it tells? Can anyone describe, please? It's a fountain. It's a fountain. It's the source of the river water, isn't it? Mm -hmm. uh, it's a downfall, yes. waterfall. Uh, waterfall, we have seen that. As it is, uh, at the same time, we have seen that some uh, green uh, trees is also, green leaves is also there, okay? Yes. Rocky area? Rocky. Yes, this is also what? Next step, next step of the downfall. Why? You have seen the water is coming from the top of the mountain, top of the mountain. Gradually what's happened? It's a what? It's a river. I have already mentioned that. That water uh, is considered as a what? The source of the river. Here we have seen the river's water. Okay? It's a river's flow. Current. Yeah. Then it's a what? Clearly visible that between two mountain, two hills, there is a river is flowing on, hmm? going on. <clears throat> then again we have seen that there is a river, mountain, but what we see that? A bit green area. Most of the hills full of rocks, there is no tree. At the same time, it's a calm and quiet place. Okay? Then can anyone describe the image? It's a forest. Hmm? It's a forest. It's a forest, but the time? Hmm? Mm -hmm. It's a dark swelling? Should it? Sun rising? Or sun setting? It's very difficult to say. In the last class, I mentioned that when the forest is full of what trees, and because of the deep forest, little bit sunshine reaches there. As a result, the forest is what? Most of the time it, it is dark at all. Isn't it? Similarly, the sun is far away because of the long trees we have seen a bit of what? The sunshine inside the forest. Okay? Why I am uh, showing the images? As you have gone through few lines of the poem, the last class you saw that it's a full of description of the hills, okay? And what are the conditions? If you see the images, then you can easily understand the lines of the poem as well. Then, what does it indicate, the image? Yes. Hmm? Mountainside. Mountainside. Then? Some houses, very few houses. Eh? Trees, then the uh, color of the hills? Green. Hmm? Green. Is there any smoke on the picture? Yes. Or behind of the hills, we have seen that there is sign of smoke. Okay? Then it's a watch. Busy. It's a busy places where we have seen that this is a what civilized area modern area modern facilities is there okay, just beside the bank of the river at the same time we have seen that it's a what crowded i mean support it indicates the experience it indicates of what experience i mean support people are not uh, what they are innocent at all okay then uh once again do I behold this step and lofty cliffs which on a wild secluded scene impresses thoughts to more day seclusion. What does it mean? Why I have shown these images? It's not, these are the secluded area. These are our isolated area from the community. As a result of what? Whenever I observe this, it, it, just think that I am there. I'm inside the hill or in the hill. What's happened? My, I'm completely isolated or secluded from the crowded area. What do you think that? Whenever you 
observe them closely then your thoughts your ideas your activities will be different than the other okay then tinta nebel the main title what is that the title original title of the poem is like that lines composed a few miles above tinter away on revisiting the banks of the way during our tour july 13 1798 the original title of the poem what is that lines composed a few miles above tinter away on revisiting the banks of the way during a to july 13 1798 it has number of indication here ave means the charts here ave means the charts which is situated where in the tin turn area i means in the isolated area okay isolated area when he visited july 13 1779 this is of what this is visiting or revisiting revisiting here it is mentioned that and at the very first line of the poem we have already seen that he has mentioned that after 5 years or five years past five summers five winters it means of what this is his re visiting period of the tour and when he uh, visited there first time 1793 1793 1798 is the revisiting time but five years back what does it mean that it happened 1793 <laughs> Mm. Mm.